Right, let's try this again. So I've just tested this and it doesn't... The audio was skipping. I had heard of Grayson, of course. Everyone had, leading up to those days before the fall of the London Tower. We all knew how it had begun. The night of the 15th of May, 1951. The night that James Grayson's life changed forever. Okay, the audio's not skipping now. Sorry. Third time in a row. Hey! We got a live one in here! We got Oh, oh Johnny! What the hell's the matter? Oh, For Christ's sakes, what is he? It's his brother. Oh, Johnny. Oh, God, oh, not him. Get him out of here. Why? Oh, Jesus. Oh. Grayson, you know the regs. We can't let him live. I know the regs, damn it. I've always wanted to do a resistance on the channel. It's the only one I've never played. His brother's death had sent Grayson over the edge. Grayson deserted his unit and went on a vendetta to destroy every Chimera conversion center he could find. Where the hell's your lieutenant? Where's Grayson? We don't know, sir. What do you mean you don't know? We can't find it him. It was his brother, sir. He found his brother. He just went crazy. He's gone. Follow me. Always wanted to do a system. I didn't meet channel. Grayson personally until the trial, months after the fall of the Chimera Tower in London. Cartwright, as his commanding officer, had been called to testify. He became a hero to many. But desertion in time of war is a capital offense, and the law would make no exceptions. This is already better than burning skies, by the way. Grayson would have died in that prison, but for the intervention of an extraordinary woman. This is way before everything went south in resistance. Good old Terminator 2 reference. On your feet, Private. Grayson, I said on your feet. The rats in here keep getting bigger and bigger. It's all right, Major. I can handle this. Right. We'll be just outside. <sighs> Private Grayson. My name is Rain Bouchard. I'm with the Marquis. I know who you're with. I am here to request your assistance. The resistance. <sighs> the resistance. You swam all the way across the channel, did you? Here to beg for help. Our mission is top secret. How did you know about this? Word gets around. We take out the tower in London. You want help with yours. Where is it? Paris? Berlin? 
Paris. <coughs> I am sure you knew that as well. So why are you here? Doing some last minute sightseeing before heading back to France. You tell me. You want to know about the conversion centers? I told you. Word gets around. How many centers have you destroyed? You want me to tell you everything I've seen? Everything I know before I stop seven or eight bullets in front of a firing squad. Is that it? No, actually. So you don't know everything. I am here to offer you a reprieve. Oh. So I get to be a grunt, working for the Marquis, taking orders from frogs. He's no Nathan Hale. No thanks, sister. You'd rather die? Here? Executed by your own people? What happened to you, Grayson? I've read your file. They turned his brother. So you lost your family. Look around. We've all lost family. Look, what do you want to know? All right, yeah. I burned down some of their shithole conversion centers. So what? They're done. The menials, the Greyjacks. Every damn one of them's gone. There's no more of us to replace them. The last center I burned out was already abandoned. The Chimera are dead. No, they're not. Wrong again. That is twice if you're counting. They're hardly dead. They're evolving. My father has spent several years working with the Marquis. Developing a serum. This serum that can stop the new conversion process. Is that the shit the Sentinels are close, get? James, with your help, your experience. I can get the materials we need to finish it. Tell car ride, I want my brother's jacket back. Sorry, I'm a big fan of Resistance and I've never played this one. We had no idea why his brother's jacket was so important to him. We had no idea how Bouchard convinced Grayson. But he agreed to work under the authority of the Marquis and became an integral part of Operation Overstrike. I like this. The plan was simple. Our intelligence corps agreed to send two squadrons to help the Marquis headquartered in Luxembourg. Stephen Cartwright, a major in the British Royal Marine Commandos, would lead the first squadron. I would lead the second squadron four hours later, but time was short. Over the past three years, the Chimera had been busy. Massive fortifications were being constructed all along the coastlines of Western Europe. Soon it would be impossible for anyone to get in or out. Our squadrons would use one of the few remaining open corridors through the Chimera defenses, a narrow strip over Rotterdam. Accompanied by the Marquis, our forces would cross Chimera lines into Luxembourg and then on to Paris. But Jesus fucking Christ, is this a movie or a game? The Marquis were wrong. <laughs> I'm not being funny, this is Metal Gear Solid 4 levels of cutscenes on a PSP game. Gaming on the go. Making the most out of that UMD disc, aren't they? did any marquee stuff so this is cool i guess they did uh, the only this is the only one i've not played i played the one where you're a fireman coastal defenses rotterdam netherlands 30th of august 1951 operation overstrike is off to a piss poor start a squadron's been ambushed by three massive gun towers and british soldiers are raining from the sky second squadron will be here soon a week ago rotterdam was clear since then the chimera sealed off the entire atlantic coastline if the bloody guerrillas were able to build all this in less than a week what have they built in france and germany which they've occupied for over two years. What about Russia, man? Uh, Private James Grayson, he's now a marquee mercenary, clearly. Jump! Everyone out now! Those gun towers are chewing us up! We'll never make it! Mayday! Mayday! Attention, second squadron. Parker, the Zerg Oh, is that's one of the turn big things. I repeat, turn back to Dover. Cut. Bloody hell, coming in hard! Rotterdam is crawling with Chimera. I left death row for this. Marquis intelligence said Rotterdam was clear. 
That is anything but bloody clear. Mallory survived the jump and has established a rally point. He will have a plan to get us out. To hell with Mallory. The second squadron will be here in an hour. I'm gonna destroy that gun and see they don't get the same welcome we got. Fucking hell, we are a madman. Injured. Here, use these. Chimera dropships scatter them everywhere for injured hybrids, but they work on humans as well. Okay, so face buttons to move. Can I restart this? Yeah. Jump! Everyone out! Skip that. Wait, you're injured. Here, use these. Chimera dropships scatter them everywhere for injured hybrids. But they work on humans as well. That's a fine aim. Let's have a look at the controls. So we are face buttons to move, shoulder button to fire, manual aim, alternate fire is okay. How do I get how do I get out of manual aim? Because I'm about to die. It's up. I'm tapping up. Right. Will you get yeah, she was gonna give me health. Okay, so face buttons is a bit take out the stacks on their back. Okay, so it's a bit wonky, but okay. I'm liking this. Okay. We can get down through the floor. Storm rifle. It's not the carbine, then. Always wanted to do a resistance for the channel, and Come on, what move. better way to do it way. than one I've never played before? Look out! I see them. How do we take cover? Taking cover. Move up to the. Uh, that was completely. Uh, you will automatically press R. Suck my dick, Chimera. Enemies jumping down! It's clear now. Let's go. Streets are crawling. Stay back. It's a health canister. If an enemy is within the four brackets on screen, your target will... Yeah, that makes sense. Shit. Hey, it's one of yours down there. Reload. Please reload. She's actually got a health bar. That's terrifying. So you can't, you really can't just spam it. Actually can't just rely on the auto aim. Take out the stacks. 
Take out the stacks. Come on, let's move. On my way. How badly are you hurt? I'm fine, but Martin jumped with me. He broke his leg up there on the second floor. Oh no. I need to reach him. Can you help me climb up there? Yes, I can, friend. I quite liked Burning Skies. Oh, do we get a bullseye? No, the BM-100 Razor is a British engineered assault rifle based on Chimera technology. Press the R button to fire bursts of highly accurate energy rounds. Hold the R button to fire multiple bursts. Press and hold the L button to begin charging the secondary fire mode. A homing energy blade that ricochets off surfaces and strikes multiple targets. While holding L, a meter in the lower right corner of the screen displays the current charge level of the spinning blade. When the blade has been charged, press R to fire the blade that will seek targets in your targeting reticule. Since the charged energy blade combines all of the ammo in the active clip, charging when the clip is full maximizes the potential. Shit, sorry. Your friend didn't make it. We shouldn't let his weapon go to waste. Can just jump back out. Get your head down. Reload it. That was not doing what I wanted. I was trying to charge it. it wasn't working though. Get moving. I don't you tell me what to do, Marky woman. Oh, turret! Shoot the smoke stacks. There's the rally point. Lieutenant Bushal, this way. Over here, hurry. Where? This way. <clears throat> okay. Ben, thank God you're alive. Yeah, she's alive. Which I can't say about a lot of my friends dropping from the sky right now. Watch your tone, Private. You're in my army now. Yeah, right. I forgot. Your army, the Marquis, who just got first squadron shot to hell. God, why are we such an asshole? We didn't know... Don't explain yourself to the rank and file, Lieutenant. Come, gun towers have been spotted up and down the coastline. Well, your orders are to stay and secure this sector. That's a load of shit. Hands in the air. Just testing their reflexes. Pretty good. Way better than your intel, guys. <laughs> Why are we an asshole? Nathan Hale was awesome. I can't remember much Bloody about the fire. frog. Oh, dog. My dog's just gone mental. Lieutenant Grayson, Major Cartwright asked me to find you. He needs your help, sir. Hello. I'm sure he asked for me. He must be in trouble. All right, let's go. Doing a bit of on-the-job voice acting. We located a down veto in a courtyard through here. Uh, power's out. You have your field torch? I always have my field Come torch. Come on, let's move. Move up. Snap to high cover. Simply push into the corner of... The oh, no. To fire, press the R button. Through here, Lieutenant. Oh no, Fenris! Whoa, nearly dead. Mm. 
Nearly died then. I mean, there's some health there. Was there some... We don't have a sprint, unfortunately. Was there some health in here? I don't want to go over to the health and then die. <laughs> This is Grayson. We've got to take out those gun towers. Second squadron is inbound. Make sure it's all reloaded. General speaking, the M, the carbine is the uh, the best gun, but we don't seem to have it yet. The second, sorry, the second best gun in the game. The Rossmore, if it's in this game, it's going to be great. Ooh, look at that death. First death. They were a bit far away. I probably should have used fire aim. We located a downed VTOL in a courtyard through here. Uh, come on, let's move. Move up. Checkpoint's not too bad. Here, Lieutenant. dead. He is dead. Alright. We'll save that health back there because we're going to need it. But generally speaking, if you get a Chimera weapon, it's better. This is Major Cartwright to all survivors. Come in. Anyone. Cartwright, this is Grayson. We've got to take out those gun towers. Second squadron is inbound. And now we know when we walk around that corner, we're going to get absolutely shredded. Can we cheese it? See, I don't want to. Hoping I can go, go forward and go forward. And then. Uh, uh, do that, yes. What is. Alt fire. I don't want to jump over and then die. I think that got him. That was the, the BMG Razor, right? So it's... I mean, it's no hedgehog grenade. But... secondary fire. Well, we've used the BMG Razor. It's weird that um, reload is on D-pad left. <laughs> but, I mean, all the controls are weird. <clears throat> Checkpoint, please. We're not Nathan. Oh, is that the Dead Eye? Is it called the Dead Eye? It was a 
bullseye. I, I can't reach the cargo compartment. Jansen, get down here on the double. Jansen! Jansen didn't make it, so you're stuck with me. Grayson, thank God. There are explosives on board that VTOL we can use to destroy those gun towers. Come down and help me reach them. Your exit is blocked. It's not one bloody thing, it's another. On my way to bail you out. Don't die instantly. The far, eh, it's the far eye. To scope, m tap up. Tap up. Under fire! Cover me, Grayson! You covered. Get your head down. He's going to die. Gonna die. I can't save him. You allowed Cartwright to die. Yeah, I ran out of sniper rifle ammo. Okay. Under fire. Cover me, Grayson. Look <laughs> at you moving out of the way, you fucking chimera and bastards. Go. I've got you covered. Look out. Look at them wrecking him instantly. They're all over me. Yeah, you're dead, mate. I can't save you. This isn't really fair. I haven't got any ammo. Look out! <laughs> Damn, Cartwright, son. Under fire! Look at his health get stripped right at the start. Doesn't give you a lot of time. Go. I've got you covered. Look out.
Yeah, this is useless for uh Take cover. Okay, I guess we'll do this in the next step part. Because they don't even want to shoot me. Yeah, they don't even want to shoot me. Under fire! Cover me, Grayson! Covered. Look out! Fucking Grayson's health, man. Yeah, I know. We, this is a, a writer. Move up. Look out. He's dead. Just died. Damn. That is. There's. Is there any? Under fire. Cover me, Grayson. Look at him. Look how quickly his health goes down. Look, he's on half health already. Go. I've got you covered. You fucking haven't, Grace. Look out! Oh, this is rough. I mean, we'll get there. Move up. Take cover. You allow Grayson to die. Cartwright to die. Grayson's the other other chap. 